Hi everyone, welcome to Craft and Crochet. In this video, I'm gonna share with you how to crochet this so beautiful and really easy baby cardigan. This cardigan is so beautiful and so soft and really easy to make. I'm gonna give you five different sizes with this same pattern. I made this cardigan for this matching set. This pattern is so soft and so comfortable for babies. I really love this pattern with this cardigan. It's really easy to make, even beginners can make too. I'm gonna give you all details step by step. I hope you will love too. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. If you're new for my channel, don't forget to join with my 100 of 1000 subscribers by clicking the subscribe button and the bell icon. If you missed my previous video, please click on my channel name Craft and Crochet. Under this video icon, you can get my all videos in here. These all videos are with the subtitle too. Okay, before I start the tutorial, I'm gonna show you my finished set. I made this baby hat to match in this set. You can get the five different size newborn to two years with the same pattern. It's so comfortable for babies. I made this baby cardigan 0 to 3 months size. I'm gonna give you 0 to 2 years, 5 different size with this same pattern. It's really easy to make, only 2 rows to repeat. It's so comfortable for babies. I really love this baby cardigan with this matching set. I made this baby romper to match in this set. It's so comfortable for babies and really easy to wear you can see it's really easy to wear this romper for the babies i really love this baby set i hope you will love too i'm gonna give you this all link in the description down below this size for zero to three month size you can get the five different size zero to two years with the same pattern and this baby blanket is so soft and so comfortable it's really nice size for the baby. I made beautiful border for this baby blanket. It's really easy to make. Both sides is look same. I'm gonna give it this all link in the description down below. I'm using this same pattern to make this baby cardigan. You can make the same cardigan with the five different size, zero to two years. This size for 0 to 3 month size. You can make the different size using different size yoke. In my previous video, I show how to make this different size yoke. You can see in here have a 5 different size. 0 to 2 years, 5 different size. I give you all link in the description down below. I'm using size 1 to make this baby cardigan. I'm using white color yarn. This yarn is double knitting yarn. This yarn recommend hook is for this yarn ball have 100 gram, 330 meters. This one yarn ball enough to make this 0 to 3 month size cardigan. I'm using 4 millimeter crochet hook to make this baby cardigan. You can use any color yarn for this baby cardigan. I'm gonna give you five different size with this. 0 to 3 month size this one 0 to 3 month size i'm gonna make 0 to 3 month size and you can make five different size using this different size yoke this one 0 to 3 3 to 6 6 to 9 9 to 12 and 1 to 2 years this is the five different size yoke i'm using size 1 0 to 3 month size This is the yolk size. You can use different size yolk for your cardigan. I'm going to make 0 to 3 month size cardigan. To begin, slip knot and a chain. We need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 
This 42 chain for the 0 to 3 month size. Turn your work to this back side. I'm using this back loop. Skip first 3 chain into the 4th chain. Skip first 3 chain into the 4th chain. 1 double crochet. Now I have a one double crochet. This first three chain I'm gonna count first double crochet. Then I have a one, two double crochet, three double crochet, four double crochet, five double crochet, and six double crochet. Now I have a one, two, three, four, five, six double crochet. I'm gonna turn this corner, chain one into the same chain, one double crochet. Again into the next chain, one double crochet. This size for zero to three month size. You can use part one video to make the this yoke. Then I'm gonna show you how to start this pattern for this cardigan. I give you a different size yoke link in the description down below. 0 to 3 month size we need 6 rows. After first 6 rows I'm gonna show you how to start the pattern for this baby cardigan. Follow the part 1 video to make this yoke. Now I'm nearly finished making this baby yoke 0 to 3 month size. I made 6 rows for this baby cardigan. You can see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I finished 6 rows for this yoke. I give you a link in the description down below this part 1. Now I have a 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 10, 14, 18, 22, 25, 27, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32 double crochet for these 6 rows. This 6 rows for the 0 to 3 month size, different size have a different number of rows. You can follow the part 1 video to get the different size yoke. This 0 to 3 month size, this 6 rows is coming exactly 0 to 3 month size cardigan. Before we start the pattern, we have to make one more row to start before we start the pattern. Now I have a 6 rows. Next row, row 7 is going with a single crochet. We increase this row, chain 1, turn your work other side into the same space, 1 single crochet into the next double crochet, 1 single crochet. 0 to 3 month size, we need into each double crochet to 1 single crochet. If you're going to make the different size, we need different number of single crochet for this round 0 to 3 month size we need for the front size 16 single crochet after 60 single crochet we're gonna join this first and second corner together now i have a 16 single crochet put this first and second corner together like this go through this first and second corner make one single crochet 0 to 3 month size we don't want to increase any single crochet into the next double crochet one single crochet again into the each double crochet to one single crochet if you're going to make the different size that mean this size for the size 1 0 to 3 month size size 2 3 to 6 month we have to increase the single crochet for this corner then we have to make into this double crochet to two single crochet into this corner we need two single crochet into this double crochet two single crochet different size we need different number of single crochet for this row 0 to 3 months, 66 single crochet, 3 to 6, 72 single crochet, 6 to 9, 80 single crochet, 9 to 12, 88 single crochet, 1 to 2 years, 
96 single crochet different size have a different number of single crochet for this row 0 to 3 month size we need 66 single crochet follow this pattern all the way to this corner put this third and fourth corner together make one single crochet and follow this pattern all the way to this row now I am finished this row 7 I made into each double crochet to one single crochet this both corner have a one single crochet here and one single crochet here then is coming all together 66 single crochet next I'm going to start the pattern for this I'm going to count this one for the row one for this pattern chain one turn your work other side into the same space one single crochet next skip one single crochet into the next single crochet skip one into the next five double crochet one double crochet two double crochet three double crochet four double crochet and five double crochet with the first shell skip next single crochet into the next one single crochet again skip one single crochet into the next five double crochet one two three four sorry four double crochet and five double crochet skip one single crochet into the next single crochet again skip one single crochet into the next five double crochet one two three four and five double crochet skip one single crochet into the next single crochet one single crochet again skip one into the next five double crochet one two three four and five double crochet skip one into the next that mean into this corner single crochet to one single crochet now you can see I have a four shell for the front side one two three four shell 0 to 3 month size we need 4 shell for the front side next I am going to start the same pattern for the back side for this cardigan skip 1 into the next 5 double crochet 1 2 3 4 and 5 double crochet skip 1 single crochet into the next single crochet you know this pattern now you can continue this pattern all the way to this back side for this cardigan next I'm going to show you how to make this corner now I'm nearly in a second corner 5 double crochet now I finished this back side for this cardigan 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 I have a 8 shell for the back side for this cardigan skip this two single crochet into this corner single crochet using this corner single crochet single crochet next skip one into the next five double crochet this shell is going to the front side for this cardigan we need four shell for this cardigan front side four double crochet five double crochet skip one into the next single crochet Continue this pattern all the way to the end of this row. Now I'm going to finish this row 1 for this pattern. This is the last shell for this row 1. 4 double crochet and 5 double crochet. You can see now I have a 1, 2, 3, 4 shell for the front side. I skip 1 single crochet into the, this last single crochet to 1 single crochet. Now I have finished this first row for this pattern. I have a 4, back side I have a 8 and front side I have a 4 shell. This is the 0 to 3 month size. 
if you're going to make three to six month we need front side four shell into this corner one back side eight into corner one again front side four altogether we need 18 shell three to six month next three to sorry six to nine months six to nine month we need front side five shell on a back side ten shell again front side five altogether twenty nine to two l we need front side five into this corner one back side ten corner one and other side corner one again front side five altogether twenty two shell one to two years we need front side six shell and a back side six shell and front side six shell altogether twenty four shell i hope you will get this all different size i'm making zero to three month size then i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen shell for the zero to three month size next row two row two is same for the all different size start with the chain three one two three turn your work other side into this same single crochet two double crochet i'm going to count this first three chain for the first double crochet then it's all together is coming one two three double crochet here i have a five double crochet skip first one two double crochet into this third double crochet using back loop only single crochet here i have a two loop you can see here i have a two loop using only back loop single crochet again into the next single crochet using only back loop five double crochet using only back loop five double crochet one two three four and five double crochet skip one two double crochet into this third double crochet using only back loop single crochet again into the next single crochet using only back loop five double crochet one two three four and five double crochet into this third double crochet top using only back loop single crochet you know this pattern now follow this pattern all the way to this row two into here single crochet into this single crochet five double crochet i'm going to show you end of this row two now i'm nearly finished this row two into this single crochet using only back loop five double crochet one two three four and five double crochet skip two double crochet into this third double crochet top using only back loop single crochet into this last single crochet using both loop three double crochet using both loop three double crochet one two and a three double crochet now you can see i'm finished two rows we not increase any shell for this row two next i'm going to start row three you can see this first row is coming to front side you this five double crochet this inside have a five double crochet we only increase for the front side shell row three chain one turn your work other side into the same space one single crochet skip this two double crochet go through this single crochet using only back loop using only back loop seven double crochet 
वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स एंड सेवन डबल क्रोशे नव आई हैव सेवन डबल क्रोशे ही आई हैव फाइव डबल क्रोशे गो थ्रू दिस थर्ड डबल क्रोशे टॉप using only back loop single crochet again into the next single crochet is coming seven double crochet using only back loop and a seven double crochet have a seven double crochet using this third double crochet top only back using only back loop single crochet this row 3 you can see this side is coming 3d shape using only this single crochet make seven double crochet for this shell top single crochet Again, this single crochet to seven double crochet. Follow this pattern all the way to this row three. Now I am nearly finished this row three. Into this third double crochet top, single crochet using only back loop. Into this single crochet using only back loop, seven double crochet. One, two, three, four, five. Six, six double crochet and the seven double crochet. Now I have a seven double crochet. I skip next two double crochet into this top of this third chain single crochet. Now I finish three rows. When you finish the three rows, you can see this front side have a five double crochet with the shell and seven double crochet with the shell. and the back side have a five double crochet you can see this only front side we increase this double crochet for the shell row 4 row 4 is going same as the row 2 this is the row 2 row 4 is going with the same as the row 2 start with the chain 3 turn you work other side into this same single crochet two more double crochet I'm going to count this first three chain for the first double crochet. Then is coming all together three double crochet. You can see one, two, three. Here I have a seven double crochet. I skip one, two, three double crochet. Top of the this four double crochet using only back loop single crochet. Again into the next. Single crochet using only back loop, five double crochet. This row is going same as the row two. Into this single crochet using only back loop, five double crochet. One, two, three, four, and a five double crochet. Again. Into the four double crochet top, using only back loop, single crochet. Again into the next single crochet, using only back loop, five double crochet. One, two, three, four, and five double crochet. Five double crochet, single crochet is going to this four double crochet top using only back loop. You know this row now. Follow this pattern all the way to this row four into this single crochet. It's coming five double crochet into this four double crochet top to single crochet. Now I am nearly finished this row four. Into this single crochet using only back loop five double crochet. Two, three, 
4 and 5 double crochet into this 4 double crochet top using only back loop single crochet into this last single crochet using both loop here have a 2 loop using both loop 3 double crochet 1 2 and 3 double crochet now I finished 4 rows you can see 1 2 3 4 4 rows when you finish the 4 rows you can see this each side have a 2 3d shell row 5 start with the chain 1 into the same space single crochet I gonna start row 5 now you can see this side have a row 2 and row 4 is going same way row 1 and row 3 you can see row 1 have a 5 double crochet row 3 have a 7 double crochet row 5 I gonna start with the 7 modern double crochet into this single crochet using only back loop modern double crochet go through the first loop next go through the next two loop and next go to the this last two loop this the modern double crochet again go through the first loop next two and next last two loop now I have a two modern double crochet three four five six and seven seven modern double crochet you can see one two three four five six seven here have a five double crochet skip two double crochet into this third double crochet top using only back loop single crochet again into the next single crochet using only back loop seven modern double crochet one two three four five six and a seven modern double crochet here I have a seven modern double crochet skip two double crochet into this third double crochet top using only back loop single crochet you can see now this the front side this is stitch using only back side into the next single crochet 7 modern double crochet follow this pattern all the way to this row 5 now I am nearly finished this row 5 into this last single crochet using only back loop 7 modern double crochet 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 modern double crochet 7 modern double crochet skip next 2 double crochet go through this third chain and single crochet now you can see I'm finished 1 2 3 4 5 rows when you finish the 5 rows you can see this front side have a 3 shell and our back side have a 2 3d shell row 6 start with the chain 3 turn your work other side into the same space 2 double crochet this row is going same as the row 2 here I have a 7 modern double crochet skip 3 modern double crochet into this 4 modern double crochet top using only back loop single crochet again into the next single crochet using only back loop 5 double crochet 3 4 and 5 5 double crochet go through this 4 modern double crochet top using only back loop single crochet follow this pattern all the way to this row 6 now I'm nearly finished this row 6 top of this 4 modern double crochet top single crochet 
into this single crochet using both loop three double crochet one two and three double crochet now you can see I'm finished one two three four five six rows next row seven is going same as the row five chain one turn your work other side into the same space single crochet into the single crochet using back loop seven modern double crochet one two three four five six and seven modern double crochet you can see i have one two three four five six seven modern double crochet into this third double crochet top using only back loop single crochet we not increase any stitch now this repeat row is row two and row five you can see this the row two row 2 is going with the 5 double crochet row 5 going with the 7 modern double crochet we have to repeat row 5 and row 2 continue this pattern to your cardigan size this 0 to 3 month size you can see this the row 4 and 7 modern double crochet with the we need eight shell this the first two shell this the seven modern double crochet one two three four five six six shell with the seven modern double crochet with the first two shell all together eight and this side inside is have a five double crochet with the shell we need all together 15 rows 0 to 3 month 15 rows 3 to 6 month 17 rows 6 to 9 19 rows 9 to 12 21 rows 1 to 2 years 23 rows after this all rows you can finish this cardigan I made 0 to 3 month size then I need altogether 15 rows now I'm nearly finished this 15 rows seven modern double crochet here I have a three double crochet into this second double crochet single crochet into this last third chain single crochet now you can see I am finished 15 rows when you finish the 15 rows you can get this inside one two three four five six seven shell and uh, this right side one two three four five six seven eight shell this side is coming with the seven modern double crochet inside is going with the five double crochet now i gonna need this side chain one into this modern double crochet to single crochet into this modern double crochet I'm going to make three single crochet single crochet to one single crochet three single crochet into this single crochet one single crochet again into this chain three space three double crochet into this single crochet single crochet Continue this pattern into this chain 3 space to 3 single crochet, single crochet to 1 single crochet. Into this double crochet is coming 2 single crochet. Continue this pattern to this corner. Now I finish this side all the way to this top single crochet. Into this top 1 single crochet. Now you can see I made this side single crochet. Next chain 1, turn your work other side. 
this side is buttonhole side sorry button side into the next single crochet one single crochet again into the next one single crochet this side is going into each single crochet to one single crochet continue this pattern all the way to this corner now i'm um, finished this side i made into each single crochet to one single crochet into this last single crochet slip stitch i'm gonna cut this yarn now i'm finished with the slip stitch I have to make one more row for this side. I'm gonna make with the last row when you finish this buttonhole side. Next, I'm gonna start this side. This side is coming buttonhole. I'm gonna use this single crochet to join the yarn. chain one and join this yarn for this single crochet this side going same as the other side single crochet to one single crochet modern double crochet is coming three single crochet one two three single crochet single crochet to one single crochet this modern double crochet to three single crochet single crochet to one single crochet and uh, this double crochet is coming two single crochet continue this pattern all the way to this corner now i'm finished single crochet all the way to this side into this top one single crochet now you can see i've finished this side with a single crochet i'm going to make one more time chain one turn your work other side before i gonna make the single crochet i'm gonna mark the buttonhole i'm gonna mark in second single crochet one buttonhole here is coming one next one I gonna mark in here I gonna add only three button if you want you can add more than three button and next one I gonna add in here this the three button hole space I'm going to show you one buttonhole how to make this chain one into this skip this buttonhole single crochet into the next single crochet single crochet again into the next single crochet all the way to this next buttonhole is coming one single crochet to one single crochet only this buttonhole space skip this buttonhole single crochet chain one into the next single crochet continue this pattern I'm going to show you one more single crochet into each single crochet this is the second buttonhole single crochet chain one chain one skip this single crochet into the next single crochet single crochet this is the second button hole again single crochet into each single crochet follow this pattern all the way to this corner now i have finished two time for this side you can see single crochet with the two rows next last row chain one turn your work other side into each single crochet 
into the next single crochet one single crochet now I'm gonna make into each single crochet to one single crochet continue this pattern all the way to the this buttonhole I'm gonna show you how to make the this buttonhole space now I made into each single crochet to one single crochet. This buttonhole is going into this chain space. Here I have a one chain into this chain space, two single crochet, one, two. Single crochet, skip this single crochet into the next single crochet. One single crochet. Again, into each single crochet to one single crochet. This the second buttonhole into this buttonhole space two single crochet one two skip next single crochet into the next single crochet to one single crochet it's really easy to follow this pattern into each single crochet to one single crochet only buttonhole space two is coming two single crochet into this buttonhole chain is coming two single crochet if you use the big size button you can make the two chain then you can make the three single crochet I'm using small size button then I made with the one chain into this last single crochet is coming one single crochet now I finished three rows for this side I made three buttonhole for this side next side I made two rows I had to make one more rows chain one into the same space one single crochet into the next single crochet one single crochet into the next one single crochet now I gotta make the single crochet between these two sing uh, double crochet again between these two double crochet one single crochet I made this single crochet around to this neck into the this space single crochet this corner turn with the skip this two double crochet into this space single crochet that's how is we turn in a corner continue this pattern all the way to the other side all the way to this neck and to this corner now i made into sorry between two double crochet to one single crochet around to this neck is coming like this next this side have a single crochet chain one into the same space single crochet into each single crochet is coming one single crochet this the third row for this side is coming into each single crochet to one single crochet now i finish this side into each single crochet to single crochet into this last single crochet to slip stitch now I'm gonna cut this yarn. I made both sides to three rows. You can see I made this buttonhole side three rows and other side three rows. You can see you can use the yarn needle to hide this yarn. I'm gonna add a smaller size button, three buttons. After that, I'm gonna show you how to make the long sleeves. Now you can see I finished adding this button. Next, I'm going to show you how to make the sleeves. All the time, I'm showing how to make the long sleeves for the right hand side. I have so many requests to make the um, left side one. I'm going to show you how to make the left side one today. I turn this work to the other side. I start with the back side. Go through this corner and join the yarn. start with the chain three this is the back side 
for this cardigan into the next double crochet one double crochet the sleeves have a 0 to 3 month size 27 double crochet I'm gonna make into each double crochet to one double crochet with the first three chain all together is coming 28 double crochet three to six months we need six sorry 30 double crochet into each double crochet is coming one double crochet continue this pattern all the way to this corner I made into each double crochet to one double crochet then is coming 27 double crochet with the first three chain is coming all together 28 double crochet join with the first third chain using by slip stitch now I have a 28 single sorry double crochet next round two round two I gonna start with the chain three one two three into the same space into this double crochet into this first double crochet one double crochet now you can see I have a one two double crochet skip next double crochet into the next double crochet skip one into the next one double crochet now into the skip double crochet space one double crochet is coming like a cross you can see I'm going to show you one more skip double crochet into the next double crochet next double crochet I'm going to make into this skip space then is coming cross like a stitch skip one into the next one double crochet into this skip double crochet to one double crochet you can see this pattern is really easy it's going to skip one double crochet into the next one double crochet into this skip double crochet space to one double crochet again skip one into the next one double crochet into the skip space one double crochet continue this pattern all around to this second round I'm going to show you end of this second round in here now I'm nearly finished this second round double crochet into the skip space one double crochet go through the first third chain and a slip stitch now you can see I'm finished second row then is coming one two sorry one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen is stitch with the cross stitch next next round is start with the same way start with the chain three one two three into this first double crochet to one double crochet skip this double crochet into this next double crochet one double crochet into this skip double crochet space one double crochet again skip one into the next double crochet into the skip space one double crochet it's really easy pattern skip one into the next one double crochet into the skip space one double crochet we can't use the same pattern for the sleeves then it's coming little bit bigger size sleeves this pattern is really easy to make continue this pattern all around to this round three now I'm nearly finished this round three skip one into the next double crochet into the skip space one double crochet go through the first third chain and a slip stitch you can see now I finished this pattern with the two round first round I made with the double crochet next round again start with the chain three into this this first double crochet to one double crochet skip one into the next double crochet into this skip space one double crochet again 
skip one into the next double crochet into this skip double crochet to one double crochet now you can follow this pattern to your sleeve size I hope you can get this pattern now the sleeves we need all together this is the first round we need one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten round without the first round this pattern with the ten round after I'm going to show you how to finish these sleeves continue this pattern to your sleeve size now I'm nearly finished row sorry round 11 this pattern with the 10 round with the first round all together 11 round you can see this both side is coming same size I'm going to reduce the stitch like this now round 12 start with the chain 3 this next double crochet to I'm gonna make front force double crochet into the next double crochet back force double crochet into the next double crochet front force double crochet again into the next back force double crochet into the next is coming front force double crochet continue this pattern all around to this round 2L I'm going to show you end of this round 2L now I'm nearly finished round 2L front force and back force double crochet finish with the front force double crochet go through the first third chain and a slip stitch this the first round for the this sleeves last round we I have to make the three round this is the first round next second round I'm gonna reduce the stitch start with the chain three into the first first double crochet to front force double crochet into the next is coming back force double crochet into this front force double crochet to front force double crochet this round I'm going to reduce the stitch. I'm going to make two front force double crochet together into the back force double crochet to back force double crochet. You can see I made two front force double crochet together in this round. This is the second round. All different size we need three rounds end of the sleeves front force double crochet to front force double crochet last loop on a hook skip back force double crochet into the next front force double crochet to front force double crochet last loop on a hook go through these three loops make one stitch next into the next back force double crochet now I have a one double two, two front force double crochet together again front force double crochet and a back force double crochet we need three doubles together I have already one back force front force double crochet back force double crochet next one is coming to this side on the front top for the sleeves two front force double crochet together last loop on a hook skip back force into the front force last loop on a hook go through these three loops and make one double now I have a two double front force double crochet front force double crochet back force double crochet next one I'm gonna make into this side we need all together three now I have already two front force double crochet together last loop on a hook skip back force double crochet into the next front force double crochet to last loop on a hook skip back force now I have a three doubles all different size we need three doubles 
three front force double crochet together sorry two front force double crochet together time th three front force double crochet go through the first third chain and slip stitch now I finish second round you can see now we have a reduce stitch one two three doubles next this is the last round you can see this last round is going front force and back force double crochet start with the chain three one two three into this front force double crochet to front force double crochet I am going to count only front force I have a one front force and a two front force back force and a three front force double crochet back force and a four front force double crochet into this double crochet four front force and a back force five front force back force six front force double crochet back force seven front force double crochet back force eight front force double crochet back force nine front force double crochet back force ten front force double crochet back force 11 front force double crochet join with the first third chain using by slip stitch now you can see last round I have a 11 front force double crochet I'm gonna cut this yarn in here I have this much yarn left I use only one yarn ball to make this cardigan this one yarn ball enough for this cardigan this both sleeves are same size now you can use the yarn needle to hide this yarn I'm going to show you how to hide this yarn it's really easy and so soft I really love this cardigan I hope you will love too when you finish this cardigan with this set don't forget to share with me in our Facebook group I give you a link in the description down below I'm gonna tie this yarn in here like this and I'm gonna pass this yarn through this front force double crochet to out like this next you can cut this yarn to closer for this sleeve size now I finished this cardigan I hope you will love this cardigan with this set if you like this video please thumbs up and share and comment down below See you again with another video.